Hello, I'm Taya Miles, and I will be reading from All That She Carried, The Journey of Ashley Sack, A Black Family Keepsake. Here in these pages, we take up a quiet story of transformative love lived and told by ordinary African-American women, Rose, Ashley, and Ruth, whose lives span the 19th and 20th centuries, slavery and freedom, the South and the North. Their love story is one of sacrifice, suffering, lament, and the rescue of a tested but resilient family lineage. By loving, Rose refused to accept the tenets of her time, that people could be treated as property, that wealth was a greater value than honor, that some lives had no worth beyond capital and gain. Hers is just one telling example of refusal from the collective experience of enslaved Black women who practiced love and preserved life when all hope seemed lost. Even when she relinquished her daughter to the slave trade against her will, Rose insisted on love. Despite and during their separation, Rose's value of love prevailed. The emotional bond between mother and daughter held longevity and elasticity, traversing the final decade of chattel slavery the chaos of the Civil War and the red dawn of emancipation before finding new expression in the early 20th century, just as a baby girl, the fifth generation of Rose's lineage, Ashley's great granddaughter was born. Just as remarkable as the story of women who dare to insist on love is preserved on an antique sack, which once held grains or seeds Traces of the abused and adored, the devalued and the salvaged, the lost and the found accrue in this one-of-a-kind object. A mother bears the sacrifice of her daughter. A daughter carries on amid unspeakable loss. A descendant heaves the harrowing tale into the 20th century, and we have the chance to be the better for its arrival here on our doorstep. Through the medium of Ashley Sack, we glimpse the visionary fortitude of enslaved Black mothers, the miraculous love Black women bore for kin, the insistence on radical humanization that Black women carried for the nation, and the immeasurable value of, of material culture to the histories of the marginalized. Thank you.